Hello and welcome back to me playing some more Final Fantasy IX. Uh, last we left off, we had just beaten a thing. Uh, let's see, where do we take us? Oops. All right. Uh, to be perfectly honest, I turned on my PlayStation to go and check out because Ghost of Tsushima is coming to PC, and I wanted to see if it was on uh, PS Plus. Because I don't know if it is or not. I think it is, but I'm not sure. And then I realized, wait, I'm in the middle of something, aren't I? And so I can't just close out of this and check. So, here I am. Garland, tell me, what is it that you want to accomplish? The restoration of Terra. Isn't it obvious? No, that's not what the people of Terra want. No, that's what the people of Terra want. Why aren't you asleep with the rest of them? I was created to oversee Terra. I exist to wait for a time when this world is without life or death. I am the absolute controller of this planet. Alright. Ah. <sighs> Um, battle boots, perfect. That's actually not really new ninja gear. Nice. Uh, he's guarded against that. Couldn't steal anything. <laughs> Psychokinesis. Auto potion. Couldn't steal anything. Wave. I mean, honestly, this is not with uh between auto potion on those two and everyone having uh regen. It's really hard to kill me. Oh, so anyway, we will we'll discuss something. I read an article the other day that um, uh, crap, what's his name? Um, uh, I can't think of his name. Anyway, he's the one who did basically almost all the uh, soundtrack for every Final Fantasy. Um, he is not going to be doing any, uh, more full game songs. He said that it takes too much time and effort, and he doesn't have the time or patience anymore. So he's not going to be able to doing that. Uh, Nobu Umatsu? Yeah. Uh, so... Yeah, he's going to be doing passion projects now, which are much shorter in uh, how long they they just take. And yeah, I, I read that the other day. I was a little sad, but it actually means that he's actually doing things. Apparently, he's doing things in with a German orchestra, making making like. Um, I should have looked it up today while I was at work, but uh, he's making like video game esque soundtracks for. Ooh, I think he should be. Nope, miss. Perfect. Doesn't have anything. All right, we'll just do this. Yeah, whatever. Uh, 
Honestly, this is not going to take long. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm kind of sad that he's not doing any more video games, but that's fine. I Like I said, I, I kind of want to go and uh, search for his music uh, and listen to it tomorrow at work. Whoa, was that glitchy? I like how even during the little animations, auto, uh, auto regen is just keep working. So I gotta take off my watch. I keep hitting it on my desk. Um, I actually, I actually keep my uh, when I'm playing. I usually keep my uh, controller under the desk itself, just because of how I sit. And so as I'm kind of moving my hand back and forth, as I'm just absolutely doing nothing, honestly, uh, I keep hitting my desk on the, or my watch on the underside of the desk. Ugh. Garland. You fight well. Give it up, Garland. What the? <laughs> this is too easy. The invincible is mine. Now I can now I have the power to control all souls. Garland gave me everything without a fight. The old fool was too busy dealing with him. Now only death awaits him. Poor Garland, bitten by his own dog. This is no accident. Fate has chosen me to become the new ruler of Terra. Time to go. Time for me to put on the finishing touches. I must say, I truly love you all. You not only broke the seal to Terra, but did me a favor of defeating Garland. Zidane, you are truly an extraordinary genome, deserving of my love. What are you doing here, Kuja? That's not a very nice way to greet your brother. Shut up, you're no brother of mine. Oh, such ferocity, Master Garland. He intends to fight Terra. Kuja, what are you scheming? Scheming? Me? Watch me as I defeat these enemies of Terra. Come now, you may sleep alongside the souls of Terra. For all eternity. All right, what has he got to steal? Oh, Demi. Stolen ether. really can't do all that much damage to me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Another Demi. I don't really like the look of this Demi. As much as I have in the past. 
Like, I actually really like uh, Eight's Demi, the way it, Eight's Demi looked, where, because it's a gravity spell. And I like the fact that it got you bigger and then shrank you down. Like it was increasing your weight and then just, or increasing your mass and then decreasing the gravity or something. It, I thought it just looked really cool. Ooh, Carbini Mail. I think that's three, because the first one was an ether, I believe. I think I'm about ready to... Auto potion. Doesn't have anything. All right. Uh... Hmm. No. Can I bad breath him? <gasps> Wait, we have holy. Wait, where's holy? Wait, I thought she had holy. Am I missing it? What does this do? Any silence, haste. Protect, Shellstone, and Pansia. Huh, weird. Oh, it looks like you can't. Alright. Uh, let's just do this, and we'll do this. Skill, Thievery. Alright. Frog drop. Not oh, ruby light. Honestly, these guys are just doing absolute massive damage to him. There's nothing Kuja can do. Wow, that actually does a lot of damage, too. Tandaga. I need to go and catch more frogs. You call that an attack? Uh, actually, it did not do a lot of damage, did it? I mean, her summons aren't doing a lot, but I mean. The every frog drop and the other one just are absolutely destroying him. That does 60. It seems to be going up in damage. That's insane. The time is now. Uh, Kuja's transform. This is the power of trance. Hump. I'll show you my true power. Ultima! Uh, 
It's okay. I'm not sure I like it as Ultima, but it is a pretty cool looking spell. Yes, this is the power I've longed for. The mighty power of souls. They assault any threat that tries to destroy them. What do you mean? It's trance. You know how it works. But a normal trance won't be enough to defeat you. You're as resilient as Oglops. Even tiny Moogles possess the power of trance. When I saw that it's Gula in Gula Volcano, I came up with a plan. It was easy. I just needed to borrow the power of the wretched souls that can't die. Where did I acquire it? It was the invincible, or should I say, the large eyeball in the sky. The ship sucked the souls of the Madain Sari and the Ifa Tree and Alexandria to feed upon them. But when it fought Bahamut at the Ifa Tree, the invincible drew in the powerful spirit. Can you guess to whom it belonged? Queen Bronze Soul, the soul of your mother. The souls trapped inside the Invincible welcomed me with open arms. They were fed up with being your prisoners, Garland. So, Master Garland, you are no longer needed, and after you've worked so hard, I shall rule Terra and Gaia with my unconditional love from now on. What will you do with such power? Master Garland, you of all people should accept defeat gracefully. Garg. How sad. Any last words? Your power is meaningless. Gah. Now it's your turn. Should I kill you quickly to show my appreciation for all you've done? Or should I kill you slowly and painfully to show you my love? Oh, I've got a great idea. How's this? I'll make you pillars for my castle. You'll all decorate my castle as a symbol of my eternal kingdom. How do you like that? No, never. You could never build an eternal kingdom. That voice. Garland? Did you leave something behind? Do you think a defect like you could last forever? What do you mean? I built you to last until the worthy genome Zedang grew. It was too dangerous to let you last any longer than that. What are you saying? There's a limit on your life. You'll be dead soon. Even as I die, you'll have died without ever leaving your mark on the world. Haha, <laughs> what an interesting lie. You're telling me that my life will end soon. Nice try, Garland. But I won't fall for your silly tricks, Garland. Garland, answer me! You were created to destroy. You are a mortal. A mortal? I'm finished? I don't believe you. Why would I believe such a silly story? You're telling me that I'll die soon. Now that I'm more powerful than anyone. I'm gonna die? Lose my soul? What comedy, Zidane, isn't it hilarious? I'll die just like the black mages I so despise. I single-handedly brought chaos into Gaia, but in the end, I'm nothing but a worthless doll. Kuja. Kuja? I won't let it happen. 
I won't. I won't let this world exist without me. Kuja, I can't believe him. Zeni, we gotta get out of here before the tower collapses. But how? We need to carry the injured out, too. Let's steal that ship. I think Kuja called it Invincible. It's at the bottom of the tower. Oh, yeah, but... Alright, you guys head for the ship. I'm gonna rescue the genomes. They're victims. I can't just abandon them. I'm coming with you. Dagger. I won't want you to leave us again. I'll keep watch over you. We should be able to go back through the warp gate on the t other tower. Dagger and I will head back to Bran Bell. You guys come get us on the Invincible. Uh, let's equip you. Do you have anything on here? No. Uh, okay, well, let's see. You know, funny thing is, I don't think she can actually learn holy, which is real weird. This, that's fine. White robe. Raises holy elemental attack. Rubber suit. Dark gear. Raises spirit. Uh, nope, we'll just keep that. Rebirth ring, you're still learning auto life. Okay. Hang on, ability. Oh, uh, auto haste, and we will do auto regen. <laughs> I had just enough for that. Okay. Oh, there's this. Oh, that's the invincible down there, I believe. Looks like the teleporter leading to the upper levels. It might bring us take us back to Bran Ball. Ah! What's wrong? Behind you! They're just eyes. It's okay, let's go. Just eyes. How very bold of you. Um, Dagger. Yes? Um, about what happened earlier... What is it, Zidane? Oh, jeez. I feel like I'm being watched. Just say it. We need to hurry. Um, you came to my rescue, right? And, uh... What you said to me. It made me really happy. Zidane. How can I say this? Um... Thanks. Hurry! This old dink, this dinky old tower is gonna collapse any minute. <laughs> oh, 
Amarant and Queen. Uh, I know find good food on Terra. Maybe I eat eyeball over there. Queen, hurry up or you'll be left behind. I happy we leave. No good food anywhere. Oh, yep, we made up to Brand Wall. I still I think we're still okay. Let's evacuate the genomes. Alright, so let's see here. Zidane, let's split up. Yeah, I'll go this way. We'll meet up at the Invincible Arrives. When the Invincible Arrives. My gosh, this ship is enormous. Judging from our current position, I believe the bridge is that way. Hold it, where's Queena? Arg. Is it late again? Oh, I arrive. I warp inside from bottom of ship. Where were you underneath? The ship is the first place. Save it for later. We must get the ship moving. And I believe that chest over there is the thing that holds the coin. What are you still doing here? We need to evacuate. What's the point? There are only empty vessels. Stop talking like that. Do you really believe what you just said? Unlike the rest of them, Garland gave me a soul that I might replace you or Kuja. But Garland is dead. Terra will soon be destroyed. What's the point? I asked myself the same question. Did you find an answer? No. But maybe the point is to just try. It's going to be hard, but I've got my friends. It isn't so bad. Hey, what's your name? Huh? Garland gave you a name, didn't he? My name is Makoto. Makoto, huh? That's a nice name. A lot of people are going to call you for that from now on. You have to find the answer yourself. It'll be hard, but you can do it. Let's go to the New World, Makoto. There you can find your answer. Dagger, where is Zidane? He'll be here any minute. He's looking for the last genome. Sorry to keep you guys waiting. Zidane. Sorry I'm late, but we got everyone. But now we got everyone. Everyone on board now. We must leave immediately. Still an ugly ship. Uh, it looks better than the Hildegard 3, though. And now it's here. We made it. Yes, we managed to escape from Terra, but... What's wrong, Freya? Well, I was talking to Amarant about it earlier. You don't think this is the end, do you? Are you talking about Kuja? Do you really think he perished with Terra? Even with his power, it's hard to believe that he'd have escaped unscathed. What do you think, Zidane? 
what will Kuja do next? He'll probably try to destroy Gaia. But how? There's one thing Garland said. Something about the tree that serves as a gateway between the souls of souls between Gaia and Terra. That must be... Yeah, the Ifa tree. Everyone! You must look. Come look. Come with me. What's up, Steiner? Can't you just tell us? It would be faster to come see on the bridge. What's up? They're just clouds. It's not a normal cloud. What? Let's lower the altitude and see. Don't you see? Our altitude is not very high, and this is all we can see. Oh, that's right. It's mist, isn't it? Then what could it be? It's mist. It's what the black mages are made of. And what used to cover the mist continent. The mist has covered all of Gaia. Why? How? Kuja, what are you planning now? Thanks, they were uneasy at first, but I think they'll get along fine. There's no need to thank me. You've done us all a great service. It wasn't a big deal. Well, anyway, everybody's gonna be okay. Are you sure it's okay for them to stay here? Of course it is. So this was Vivi's idea? Yeah. He wanted the genomes to start their lives, their new lives here. We're similar in many ways. Maybe we can understand them better, and they might open up to us. Right. He also said, If you guys can get along with the genomes, maybe humans and black mages can live alongside each other someday. Like you and Vivi. I didn't even know if I truly understood him until recently. We'll take good care of them. Your friends are our friends. Thanks. Yeah, except he's gonna die soon. Is it a monster? It's a- he's a chocobo. Not a monster. He's called Bobby Corwin. <laughs> what a weird name. Oh, you gave him a name. Yeah, Bobby Corwin. Isn't it a great name? Sounds great. Bobby Corwin, huh? I think Bobby Corwin likes you. It won't bite. Oh, come on. He's just a little baby chocobo. Bobby Corwin, no, come back. Wow, I think Bobby Corwin really likes our new friend. Can't you just call him by his first name? That is his first name. Why do you display these items? Why? For the customers, I think. What are customers? Well, they bring money, and they hand the money over to the shop, and then... What is money? Money is, uh... What you care about small things. World is a very simple place. World only have two things. Things you can eat, and things you can't eat. Does the water ever stay still? Water flows, doesn't it? The water of Bramball was always still. Hey, did you know that time flows just like water? So water and time both flow in Gaia. Looks like they're off to a good start. 
Humph. It's like watching kids play. It's not their fault. They've only just begun to live their lives. Can lost time be recovered? I don't know, but there's only one thing we can do. Of course. We must protect them from anyone who tries to take their time away from them. <laughs> Princess, is this really what you wish? Hmm? What are you talking about? Kuja must have done something in the Ifa tree to cover the world in mist. Do you not think it wise to consult Regent Sid before the final battle? Kuja probably plans on destroying Gaia. If I go to Lindblom now and tell Regent Sid about it, it might cause a panic. I'm sure everyone is apprehensive about the reappearance of the mist. I need Uncle Sid to protect Lindblom right now. Indeed, we must defeat the enemy on our own. If we go back to Lindblom to get equipped, please don't tell Uncle Sid about our plans. Are we ready? Yes, let's go. You haven't got a chance. You saw Kuja's power. He destroyed the world by himself. You don't even have a million and one chance of defeating him. You'll all die. Wow, this girl knows lots of difficult words. Doesn't she? She's a bit cynical, but take good care of her, will you? Her name is Makoto. She's kind of like my little sister. What? Makoto, listen to your big brother and just and make some friends. How silly. We might be desperate insects to Kuja, but I'll show you how powerful we can be. Even a fly lives for a day. I don't think that's what Zidane meant. Let's go to the Ifa tree. We won't let Kuja have his way. So Zidane is permanently just in your party. Um, let's see here. You're still only 54. You're still 65. 64, 62, 63. Okay, so Amarant. Okay, and uh, Queen Ed appears. Okay. I think that's the party I had before, too. Alright. Uh, so, first thing we're going to do is we're going to go in and we're going to go like this. We're going to grab that chest right here. Boom. And with this... Uh, depart. Oh. This doesn't handle much better, but it seems like it's quicker. Jeez, I can't see anything. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, that takes a while. Alright. Time to save it. And I do believe we are on disc four. And we are on disc four. All right, I'm gonna call it there for an episode. Thank you all for joining me on this adventure. You can take a look down in the description for a link to the Free Time Creators Collective Discord. It's a place where a bunch of us small time creators just hang out and generally talk to everybody and and uh, everybody who kind of watches our videos and stuff like that. You can find links to people's channels. People like Big Baby J, I'm Not Great, K Dog's Kennel, Holly's Adventures, Stubbs the Wizard, The Opposable Plum, and many more. They all play games kind of similar to this, and would love to have you stop by and say hello. But until next time, do stay safe out there, and we will see you in the next video. Bye now.